Nearly a dozen people pulled from the water and it's just the latest incident during a difficult summer for first responders. Good evening everyone. I'm Amanda Hill and I'm Brian Yacono. 11 people were thrown from their canoes on the Saco River near Freiburg yesterday. Emergency crews in western Maine and northeastern New Hampshire say they have been very busy for the past few weeks. News Center Maine's Jack Mulmid joins us from Conway, New Hampshire along the Saco River with more Jack. Hey, Brian and Amanda. Well, the Conway Fire Chief tells me that so far this summer they've rescued 25 people throughout the summer. Said that's a massive number compared to the average of six to 10 people that they rescue every single year. All this is going on while canoe rental companies say that they're struggling financially as they're not renting out while water levels are this high. This has been our worst summer in 25 years. Not filling the rivers. In the For Saco canoe rental owner Pete Gagney, he doesn't know why anyone would go canoeing in this. I mean, unfortunately, you could drowning could be a risk, um, but also just getting stranded out there. He's only been open so far five days in the last month. It's been very frustrating. Constant periods of rain have saturated the ground, causing the Saco River to flood by several feet. The more water you have, when people go river tubing, it's tough to control the tube at these current uh, speeds. But that doesn't stop people from ignoring the blatant warning. Uh, fortunately, they were wearing life jackets, so they were not swept underwater, where uh, the outcome might have been terrible. That's Conway's fire chief, Stephen Solomon, who says a massive 11-person rescue in the Saco River could have been deadly. To me, it is pure luck that nobody was killed yesterday. Um, it's an extreme high-risk scenario for the rescuers themselves, uh, as well as these people that actually, they were still in the water. It took more than an hour to respond to the people who fell off their canoes over in Freiburg, and that's because Conway is one of the only stations in the region with a swift water rescue team. It was a complex rescue. So how many people sit in each one? Already down one engine, and 23 people have been rescued so far this year. A normal summer is 6 to 10 for the total year. A bad move to go in the river, at least until it stops raining, which so far doesn't seem to slow down. This week here, just be safe. Please, before you go into any river in New England with all this flooding, is know before you go. Make sure you have a life jacket. Canoes and kayaks, the same thing. The Conway Fire Chief tells me that everybody who was rescued yesterday is safe and sound. Now, regarding the rental company that did allow those people to go out on those canoes, the Freiburg Fire Department, the fire chief, he did tell me that that company, that rental company, will have to foot the bill for those rescue efforts. Reporting live in Conway, Jack Mulmud, News Center, Maine.